this is Crackle.com. Now, for those of you not familiar with this, um, Crackle is another one of those um, movie and TV show streaming services. Um, it doesn't have as much content as things like Tubi or um, Peacock. I'm not sure, but um, this is a website that, like, you know, has certain movies like they take on and off, on and off, like on a monthly basis. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna go through. I'm um, like, we're gonna start with TV first. And um, I never looked through the TV sections before, so I'm going to see what they have. And um, so let's see what they have to offer us for the month of October. Let's see, they got 21 Jump Street, just like almost every other streaming service I, I've seen. Um, they got All in the Family. And Crackle makes their own like original content, too. Like Chicken Soup for the Souls, Animal Tales. Um, so when you see Crackle exclusive or something, you can tell... That's like one of their own things they produced. Go down slow, you can see the Beast with Patrick Swayze. Like the last thing he did before he died. Um, I don't, I can't remember if I've seen that show or not. Um, Bewitched, um, the original Cara Burnett show, um, Celebrity Bowling, um, The Critic, The Dana Carvey Show, Dennis the Menace, Dilbert. Fantasy Island. A lot of these I didn't know was on Crackle. Um, and um, this is one of those ones where you have to sit through lots and lots of, ad of ads. So, yeah. Hell's Kitchen. Jackie Chan Adventures. Um, Men in Black, the series, the cartoon, the Michael J. Fox show. Um... I like how this is laid out and stuff. Um, I don't know why. I just like seeing the big thumbnails and stuff. And Shameless. There's no thumbnail on it for some reason. So I can't tell if that's the British version or the William H. Macy one. Street Fighter 2. The anime series. Weird Al. And as you can see, they're all in alphabetical order. Which is another one I like liked about this. And Zorro. Um... From 1990, it looks like a 90s series of Zorro. So that's the TV shows of what they have to offer. I'm just giving you an idea. Um, they, you can categorize them in like alphabetical order, or recently added, or any genres. Like they have all the genres here, as you can see. Like same thing with the movies. Um. So now let's get on to the movies because um, there's like a just a. I feel like the TV show has a good selection, but this one like sometimes has some like mediocre selection of films um, so uh, and at some point they had like 10 Cloverfield Lane and um, one of the Charlie Brown movies as well as Michael Bay's Ninja Turtles films um, Dr. Strangelove, Easy Rider, Giant Town, a lot of classics but like I said they take some on and off and you never tell can never know which ones can be like they they don't tell you which ones are leaving and whatnot you know you have to watching the Vance, and there's a lot of sports stuff, as you can see, and some... Let me know if you ever heard any of those things. Any of those movies, like, got 99 Homes, um, and also, so, like, Crackle movies as well, like, <laughs> like, Joe Dirt 2 was made for Crackle, and I know it's not on there anymore. Who cares? That movie was bad. <laughs> the first Joe Dirt was also on here, but that was a better movie, but Joe Dirt's not on right now, um, so... It's going down very slowly. And some of these movies, like, you could see, like, few, like, Are You Here? I think that's still on YouTube. And some you can watch on Tubi, um, from what I can recall. And, um, another streaming service I might go through, it's, like, sometime soon. Another one I don't hear many people talk about. Another one worth seeing. And there's Bernie, the Jack Black film. The big hit with Mark Wahlberg. That was fine. I think it was him like when he was in his 20s or something. Like a young Mark Wahlberg. Um, the Blob um, the horror film that was just recently added on to, to, on, to Crackle. It was on Crackle before, before it got taken off and they just recently added it back in. So, alright. Boogeyman sequels. Um... Bucky Larson, Born to be a Star, 
yeah, these are like there's like a few well known, but for the most part, majority of them are just not that well known. I felt like the TV show had a lot more well known stuff, like TV stuff. I meant um, this was an interesting documentary, cleaning up the town, remembering the Ghostbusters, like like I like the way it was edited and stuff. And it's an interesting documentary. Definitely watch it if you're a fan of the Ghostbusters. And of course, they have the trailer for it in case you want to look up what what is it all about. Uh, Cool World, The Conversation, um, Crocodile Dundee in Los Angeles. That's been on Crackle for a long time. I don't think it was ever taken off once since I discovered it. Um, Day of the Dead. I think that's Day of the Dead remake. And it, just like with the TV shows, they have an alphabetical, the movies are listed in alphabetical order. The Double Dragon film. Um, and um, there's a couple Ernest films on here, like Ernest Goes to School, Ernest in the Army, Ernest Rides Again. I think those films are also still on YouTube and Tubi, but I'm not sure. But those are the ones I always see that they're on for free for streaming. Um, I don't know if the Ernest films that were distributed by Disney are on Disney+, Plus, but yeah, these aren't. Like, uh, just a... Uh, Snappers list. Like I always like to look through these once a month, see if they have any a lot of good ones on here. But it's just not that much good ones I can tell. Like I've not watched a lot all of these, so you know. Hard Rain, Morgan Freeman. Imagine that with Eddie Murphy. Jojo Dancer, Your Life is Calling. I don't know. Some Richard Pryor thing. I don't know. I'm just trying to say something. Kicking it old school. Um, Labor Pains. And The Legend of Zorro. Magic, magic. I'm trying to think of something else. Like there's the fantastic films, like other films that was used to be on Crackle that aren't on here right now as I'm rec recording this video. I think there was another Mark Wahlberg film that he did with Walking Phoenix. I know it's not on there. I was just on. I just was on this website tonight watching something. Rubber, the killer tire movie, is on here too. Um, Sasquatch Gang. See no evil, hear no evil. That's a funny movie starring um, G. Wilder and Richard Pryor. Um, G. Wilder's um, I think Death. Yeah, and Richard Pryor's Blind. A man gets murdered and they get framed for it and they have to go after to find the actual killer. It's a funny movie. I definitely would recommend watching watching it. It's, it's one of my favorite things. They've, my, actually, my favorite thing they've done together. It's, uh, stolen Nicolas Cage film, Struck by Lightning. Sunset Boulevard. Tag, not that comedy from 2018, whenever that came out. I don't know what tag it is. Three Stooges Meet Hercules. Tom Petty running down the dream. Just about done. Great Power, the Stanley story. Wuthering Heights, and yeah, that's it. So that's crackle.com. Yeah, um, they have a, like very few good selection of movies. Um, I think Tubi is um, a bit better because it has a lot of good content and Peacock, I prefer Peacock over Crackle. And this is like, just like with Tubi, you don't have to have like open an account or pay a subscription for it. You could just go on Crackle and watch stuff for free. But you have to sit through tons and tons of ads. So if you're up for it, definitely check this website out. Nothing special though, so... Um, but I still like to check it out on a monthly basis. I just like it when they add 
um, you know, more stuff to their service. So it's it's not it's not a big waste of time for me.